I'm Simon Perriman. I'm here at Microsoft Headquarters, and I'm going to show you how you can manage updates from Microsoft. An update is an updated piece of code. This could be for an application, a program, or some other product. It's always important to keep your applications up to date to ensure that they don't have any security vulnerabilities or any bugs in them. And additionally, these updates often include new features to make your programs or applications even better. Now, updates and patches, they're often used interchangeably. Essentially, they're the same thing. It's a new piece of code that you download from Microsoft to go and replace some existing code on your computer. Let's take a look at how we can manage these. From our Start menu, we search for Windows Update and select our main Windows Update portal. From the default view, you see a list of updates that are already available for download. If we want to check for additional updates, we can select the option Check for Updates. And what will happen is your computer will go and connect through the internet to Microsoft. It will figure out what updates you have installed, what updates you still need, and recommend those to you that are missing. In this case, you can see that I have 16 that are currently available. We see what we call important updates, which are recommended, and then optional updates as well, which may be nice to have but aren't critical for the system. When I go back to my main updates page, I also have the ability to change the settings. As we take a look at the settings, we see four different options for what we actually want to do with our updates. We recommend that we install the updates automatically for you. This ensures that your system is up to date and has the best application and best experience for you. But you also have the ability to download the update in the background and install it at your convenience. You can check for updates, but never actually download them. And this just means that a notification will appear saying, new updates are available. Would you like to add them? And then finally, you can not check for updates at all. But we do not recommend this, because it's going to mean that your computer is not protected. Now in this case, we want to make sure that our updates are enforced, that our computer stays patched. So I'm going to go ahead and start the process to install all of my different updates by simply clicking the Install button.